All right, here we are back for last demos of You Will Die Here tonight. I'm excited to try these out. Got a little sidetracked with uh, life and other things that were going on. But um, yeah, let's do it. Day five. Vincent Charles, rank captain, specialization team leader, age 46, height 6'2", weight 185 I guess pounds, right? Uh, blood type AB. Do it. At this point, I kind of just want this game to come out already. My head. No, gotta focus. This mission isn't over until I say it is. Ares was tasked to find Monroe, and that's exactly what we're going to do. I got one pistol and one clip, but this team dies over my dead body. Yeah, I think, I think you're right about that, my friend. Damn, hope none of the tuxedos were rentals. Looks like we took them down without a single casualty. Outstanding, maybe we don't need backup after all. Not sure taking one of these things alive for an interrogation would do any good. You bastards ain't in our mission, you're just in our way. Oh. Whoops, I locked the door. Well, I don't love that I wasted ammo on that dingling, but whatever. It happens. God, you know what? Let's just restart this. gone incredibly poorly right from the get-go. Also, those rooms are familiar. I kind of wanted to see if we can check the other side out real quick. Okay, so no is the answer. Also, Kind of wanted to see what this was. Man, this painting looks like he was alive a hundred years ago, but with one little problem. He also looks exactly like Monroe, the child-killing murderer we were sent here to find. What the hell is this? Some kind of psycho palace he built for himself? Creepy. The box of bullets. Hell yeah. Yeah, I definitely should have explored more, I think. I don't mind fight. Ooh, health, first aid kit. I don't mind fighting a bunch of enemies. Hell, it's kind of my favorite way to play survival horror stuff. But definitely need to act a little bit smarter. Okay, so we have to go the way that I was going last time. Okay. I mean, now we know. Now I know. So that's fine. He's up here. I think I want to lure him all the way over here. Sounds like there might be another one over here, though. No. Probably up here, though, right? Wait, what? Oh. That really sucks. Bullets. Okay. Oh, man. We're actually getting kitted out. What is this? Blood looks a lot more natural than whatever was coming out of those creatures. Somebody on the team is bleeding out this bad, I don't have much time to find them. 
Lieutenant, what the hell are you doing stumbling around in that corner? Uh-oh. What's going into you, son? Oh, no. Walski, step up, snap out of it. I expect this kind of foolishness from him, but you should know better. I'm kidding myself. They got nothing but dead eyes. I'm proud of you. Both of you. But it comes down to this. Go ahead and do a reload here. Lieutenant, you are a damn lunatic. How the hell did you get yourself into this situation? Set of bloody dog tags. I know your mama lives out in the middle of nowhere, son, but I'll get this to her. Lieutenant Kowalski, crap. Glad I was the one to put you down, Ashley. Not a, sure everyone on the team could have done it. Set of dog tags issued to all members of Ares Division. We never told you, but I served with your father and uncle in Desert Storm. They'll be proud to have these. Oh my god, what the fuck is that thing? No, 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 just go. Jesus Christ, what the hell was up with that maid? I got to prioritize saving people on our team who weren't built for this. Is this some kind of dungeon? This freaky magic keeps getting freakier. Jesus Christ. That thing scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> Is this the hallway with the boulder? It is. Specialist Kelly, is that you? This boulder flattened him like a wet pile of dough. You search the corpse. Instead of dog tags issued to all members of Ares Division, looks like he found a grenade launcher. No ammo left in it though. You weren't trained to use one of these, Kelly. Don't tell me you tried to shoot a grenade at a damn boulder. <laughs> Another tuxedo massacre. Well done, Ares. Maybe I was wrong about Specialist Kelly. He wasn't lying about having superior eye-hand coordination. Oh. A large dusty trunk. Double-barreled shotgun. Okay. Shotgun shells here, too. How do I equip? exactly the way you want it to. Oh my god. Good lord. How the hell there? I was gonna say, how the hell do I bring up my healing again? Got it. Use both of those. Hmm, it seems I can't reload. Maybe because I'm full? I'm guessing? Oh, there wasn't even anything over here. Oh, there we go. Now I can.
That was just stupid damage. Me acting like a fool. Yeah, this this was brutal. Rise and shine, Rodriguez. No time to rest your eyes, old man. We got god damn it, he's dead. I know things were never the same between you and your wife after what happened to Rosa. I'll make sure these get buried with her, even if it means not telling anybody. That demo was freaking brutal. The doorway. What? A lab? This room. Most of it looks like a lab straight out of Ares headquarters. No idea how it got here. It should make a good safe room. Okay. <gasps> safe room music? Can't go up the ladder. Catherine. Okay. Thank God you're all right. Captain Charles, it's good to see you. This place is dangerous. What happened to the rest of the team? What the fuck is going on here? They didn't make it. We gotta work together and find a way out of here. That's terrible news. I may know of a way to escape. The ladder behind you should take us to the library above. Great job, Colonel. There's hope yet. Wait here while I secure our exit. She's a Wesker. Sure. Okay. Goodbye, Vincent. She's a Wesker. Alright, that was pretty, pretty good. And now we have the last one here, which, uh, yeah. See you guys next time for that one.